Harry and Meghan are speechless with fury after the palace allegedly rejected several of their requests for the high-profile event. This latest controversy threatens to reignite the rift between the Sussexes and the royal family, which widened considerably after their bombshell interview with Oprah Winfrey in 2021. While the official details remain under wraps, the rumor mill is churning, painting a picture of a demanding duchess and a frustrated palace. Meghan, a former actress known for her meticulous attention to detail, has reportedly requested specific security arrangements, a prominent role in the Jubilee proceedings, and a guarantee of positive media coverage, all of which, according to sources, have been met with hesitation from the palace. The Sussexes' security demands are a point of particular contention. Having stepped back from their senior royal roles, they no longer receive automatic taxpayer-funded security. However, they insist on a level of protection that some perceive as excessive, especially considering their diminished public profile. The palace's position is said to be one of caution. Balancing the couple's safety concerns with the significant cost of private security is a delicate act. Additionally, integrating their private security detail with the meticulously planned official security measures for the Jubilee presents logistical challenges. Beyond security, reports suggest that Meghan also desired a more prominent role in the public aspects of the Jubilee. Jubilee. This has allegedly caused friction with other senior royals, particularly those who have diligently served the crown for decades. The palace's focus, unsurprisingly, is on celebrating the Queen's 70 years of service, and some insiders believe Meghan's request overshadows the true purpose of the event. Fueling the flames is the reported demand for guaranteed positive media coverage. This has gone down poorly within the palace, seen as an attempt to control the narrative and a stark contrast to the Queen's traditional approach of accepting media scrutiny with grace. The Sussexes' perspective is likely quite different. They may feel their requests are reasonable, driven by a desire for safety and respect. Meghan, accustomed to the control of Hollywood sets, might find the palace's protocols stifling. Harry, caught between his family and his wife, is likely experiencing a great deal of internal conflict. This isn't the first time the couple's wishes have clashed with royal protocol. Their decision to step back from royal duties and pursue financial independence was a major point of contention. The Tell All Oprah interview, which aired accusations of racism within the royal family, further strained the relationship. The upcoming Jubilee is a pivotal moment for the monarchy. Queen Elizabeth's reign has been a period of stability and national unity. However, the Sussexes' presence and the potential for renewed drama threatens to overshadow the celebratory occasion. The public, too, is likely to be divided. Some will side with the palace, viewing the Sussexes' demands as unrealistic and self-serving. Others will sympathize with their desire for control and respect. One thing is certain. The Platinum Jubilee is shaping up to be a dramatic event, not just for the royals themselves, but for the public who follow their every move. Will the Sussexes and the palace find a way to bridge the divide, or will this latest disagreement deepen the existing rift? Only time